Hi, it's Ryan Wetzelblatt, ADHD Dude. If you have a question you would like me to answer in an upcoming video, please head over to Attitude Magazine's website and go to the ADHD and Boys section where you could submit your question there. So these parents asked about their son who has a propensity to smother other boys when he makes a new friend. And sometimes other boys have, you know, this reaction to it where they start to pull away from him or say that they don't want to be his friend anymore, that he feels very rejected and makes self-defeating comments or suicidal comments. So one thing I want to explain to you is that, number one, there's a term going around right now in the ADHD world called rejection sensitivity dysphoria. And I do believe that is definitely part of the profile of ADHD. And the bigger picture I want you to understand is that kids with ADHD tend to be sensitive in general. You know, they tend to feel emotions stronger. Um, they tend to have a lot of empathy for other people, even though they don't always show it, you know, and also for animals as well. So what happens a lot with kids with ADHD is they find a new friend and they think, okay, great, this is the one who's going to be my buddy. He's not going to leave me. So they tend to smother him because they're so excited they have a new friend and they don't want to lose him. So they just kind of, you know, they, they basically, right, they smother him with so much attention that it starts to feel uncomfortable to other kids. The reason why this happens is because they have difficulty with perspective taking or understanding how they're coming across to others. So one of the things that we have to teach kids is that with friendships, you know, that less is more at the beginning and what's more important is to show interest in them, not the quantity of time we spend with them. And showing interest looks like talking about things they like talking about, not just what you want to talk about. Um, talking about things that you both like like, you know, doing things that they like. So being flexible enough to go along with their ideas, not just your ideas. So those are the things that are going to help. And But you also, as a parent, you need to kind of help your son rein it in a little bit and explain to him that maybe, you know, your friend's thoughts are he's starting to get a little tired because of how much you're texting him or because of, you know, you're, he's the only person you're talking to at recess. So it's really normal for kids with ADHD to become jealous of other kids as well when they spend time, when they want to spend time with other kids and you have to help them with that too, to help him understand because particularly if he thinks very black and white, that just because you know his friend wants to spend time with other kids, it doesn't mean he doesn't like him. It means he just likes to be around other kids as well. Okay, hope this is helpful and please feel free to subscribe to the ADHD Dude YouTube channel and join the ADHD Dude Facebook group if you're not there already. I'll talk to you soon, take care. Bye.